Hi, welcome and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Lindsay and I love to make Target shop with me. So if you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button below. I would love to have you here. As always, I will link as much as I can to the Target dollar spot down below, but sometimes they don't have most of the items because they're new. I'm gonna start here with these little bread containers. I think they're so cute. They have one in black and one in white in two different prints. And then they also had these laundry drying racks, which I thought was a great concept for $5. They have one in white and one in black. I know they've been circulating the internet, but I finally came across them and wanted to share. This is what they look like opened up. This is the best I could open it with the little um, wrap around the outside. And then moving along, they had some of these faux planters that um, you can hang. So I found three different kinds that I'm going to show you here. They had a mix of just like plants and succulents, so enjoy. I finally came across some Easter decor in the dollar spot. I'm so excited. So they had these ceramic bunnies for $3. I picked myself up two of them, love them. I feel like if you would go to Hobby Lobby, Michaels, you would spend so much more for them. So I told myself I am strictly buying Easter decor in the dollar spot this year and that is it. Um, so here is one bunny and then they also had this cute little container so like the top comes off like a lid. You could put candies in there, jelly beans. At first I thought it was for butter but it's definitely not. It's more for like candies. So just to give you an idea you could set that on an end table somewhere. I know these gumball containers have been circulating the internet for like a long time now. They do bring them out occasionally throughout the year. You know, they were here around Christmas and now they're back again. So I wanted to show you they do have them back in the dollar spot. So if you want to check your local dollar spot and see if they have them for you, they also have this cute I choose you window clings that I feel would look really neat on the window by the gumball container. Um, you could put the gumball container on like a, um, end table and then have it by the window. That would be really cute. I believe I showed these large hanging baskets before, but I'm not sure if I showed this specific one. So I wanted to show you again. This is something new that I have found and I don't remember seeing this exact one previously. I am going to show you a few items for kids because I feel like there's some things now in the dollar spot that you could put in an Easter basket or Valentine's Day basket. I found this cotton candy that has like pretend treasures in it. So they're like um, what you would find in Lucky Charms, the marshmallows. So I think that's really neat. And then these pop tubes are amazing for $3. I bought these for my son off of Amazon for like $8.99. They are so entertaining. I even love playing with them. You can stretch them. You can make letters with them. You can make a jump rope with them. So definitely recommend. They also had these fun oodles that apparently you're able to stretch really far apart. Um, so definitely check that out as well if you're looking for Easter basket ideas in advance. I found these busy bolts that I thought were really neat too. So basically children can practice their fine motor skills with screwing and unscrewing the bolts and then they can mix and match the colors too. If you're looking for last minute basket ideas for Valentine's Day, they did have a collection of three that I wanted to share with you. So make your way over to the dollar spot prior to Valentine's Day and they may still have some stuff left. Of course, the dollar spot continues to bring out cute little items and decor items for the laundry room. So I love this one here. And then there's also another laundry decor right here that says um, laundry, laundry room open 24 hours, which is definitely true in my household. And then I did come across these cute little um, dish towels that are like meant for the fur mamas out there. So definitely check them out if you have a little fur baby at home. 
they had a few for puppy dogs and then also they had just a few additional items that are non-seasonal you could use them year round i love this blue dish towel here i feel like it's great transition into the spring it's a very pretty blue color it's probably my favorite out of all the ones that i saw this time around If you haven't seen this cute little Montessori house um, in the dollar spot previously, I would recommend. It's really neat for kids to put like their cars and trucks. They could put little dolls in there and just for like such a good price, you know, uh, kids love this stuff and they can learn and explore. I also found this bug science kit. Again, if you're looking for Easter, Valentine's Day items, I feel like you can find something right now in the dollar spot because they have brought out a few new things. I also bought my son something similar on Amazon, this little word finder for like $15 on Amazon. This is a much better buy. If you want to teach your children how to spell, they could use that little um, ruler that they have. And then I also found these baskets, love them. They are very, very well made, very sturdy. There's only one handle, so I assume it's like to pull out of like a shelf. Um, you would have like the handle facing you so you could just pull out and grab what you want. I want one so bad, but I don't know what I need it for. So I have to ponder about that first and then maybe go back and grab some if they still have it. If you need a large lip balm, they have that for a dollar. Again, that would make a great Valentine's gift. If you're looking to give um, student stuff in the classroom, you could buy the kids each one of those for a dollar each. That is going to conclude today's video my friends thank you for being here thank you for watching if you enjoyed today's video and want to see more like it in the future be sure to give this video a big thumbs up subscribe if you're new and i'll see you guys in the next one bye guys